Hey there folks, I hope everyone is doing well today and uh, I have two huge announcements for you guys. I uh, announced them on my last stream, uh, but that wasn't really an official thing, that was just kind of a sneak peek for anyone who managed to make it to the stream or watched the VOD. Uh, but there's been a lot going on with me lately and uh, it's now time to explain what that is and tell you what's happening. Uh, we're just in our Tightening the Belt factory here. This is kind of some background, not actually going to do anything, but uh, just for something for you to watch. Uh, so the first one, uh, this one is actually probably the lesser of the two announcements, but still very, uh, very big in my opinion, uh, is I am now offering one-on-one uh, -on -one, uh, Factorio consultations, coaching, tutorials, lessons, whatever you want to call it. Uh, you can book them on my website, which is always linked in the description of my videos. Uh, it's xtermvideos.com. And uh, so what this is, what is this? Uh, it's something I've been, I've been working on for quite a while and I had my uh, web guy, Sinrise, working on it for quite a while. Uh, but you can now go there and uh, book, you know, one-on-one -on -one sessions. And this can be uh, geared towards pretty much whatever you want or whatever you need help with. So first off, you're probably thinking, well, you know, why would I do that when I could just go watch, you know, free tutorial videos? And for some stuff, the tutorial videos may be better. Uh, but, but, you know, a one-on-one, -on -one, uh, you know, kind of walkthrough can offer a lot more than a tutorial uh, because, you know, if at some point you're, you're confused about how something's being explained, you know, you, in, in a tutorial video, you can't really do much except pause it and rewatch the same explanation or ask in the comments and, you know, that's iffy if you're going to get a response or not. Uh, but in a, you know, in a one-on-one -on -one session, you can you know, be like, oh, hold on, you know, I don't understand this. Can you explain it in a different way? And we can go over it in a different way so you can understand it. Um, you know, you can ask questions that may come to you in the moment, whereas with a video, obviously, if you have other questions you think of, again, you have to rely on the comments. Uh, but so what, what exactly does this entail? Well, like I said, it can be pretty much whatever you want. Uh, you know, it can be a, a base walkthrough. There is an option in the form to submit a save. If you have a save, you want to walk through together and uh, it's going to be, you know, and again, you're probably thinking, well, you know, you did the refactorizing thing with Will. Why wouldn't I just go watch that? Uh, well, one, it's over. Uh, but two, you know, that's still different because this we would actually walk through together we go into multiplayer, go into your safe, and we go through, uh, you know, if you had specific things you needed help with, uh, we could we could fix those, we could do that, uh, or we can, you know, just go through and fix anything that I may notice and kind of answer questions, or if you're having problems in, like, what direction to be going, we can go over that, uh, or, or, or if it's not a save, it can be something uh, more specific, you know, if you're having problems with some sort of build or how to set up a certain thing, like, you just can't really understand how to do... Uh, blue science or whatever, uh, you know, we can we can go into a game together and walk through different builds together and how it works and and what goes into it and all that. Or if you're having problems with the main bus and such, uh, we can do all that. Uh, you know, pretty much whatever uh, whatever that you have questions with and need help with that you know think would be uh, you know best served in a more of a coaching one-on-one uh, -on -one tutorial type of thing. Uh, now there are, I do want to mention that there are a couple things that I will be uh, excluding I need to put on the site, but I will mention here uh, anything to do with circuit networks past the most basic stuff. I uh, am not qualified enough to, uh, you know, give tutorials on, so I don't want to offer something I can't do. Uh, so those are unfortunately going to be out until at some point I learn them better. Uh, the basic stuff, you know, if you just have no clue about circuit networks and you just want to understand the general stuff, I can help you with that. Uh, but anything with like, you know, more advanced combinator stuff, I unfortunately will not be able to assist with. Uh, super advanced train stuff, I may or may not be able to. A general, at this point, uh, I would I would consider myself uh, okay enough to, you know, give direction on general train systems and signaling and such. But if you want to do some like crazy smart train system with <laughs> these ridiculous like 16 lane junctions or something, uh, then that may may not be uh, something I can entirely help with. But uh, other than that, pretty much everything else is open. So if you guys think that you would be interested, definitely head over there. I, uh, I'll mention it in my next few videos as well. I'm really excited about it. I hope people do book some sessions and are as excited as I am. I think it's pretty cool. You know, in, in other games offer it as well. You know, I thought I thought about it for a while and I was like, well, is this something that's really realistic or not? But then I started thinking, you know, and it's like, you know, they do the same thing for StarCraft. They do the same thing for, 
you know, whatever, Overwatch, League of Legends, you know, those are competitive games, but it doesn't really matter. Uh, if you want to get better at the game, it can be a great way to do so. Uh, and, and even in real life, you know, you, you know, some people take uh, piano lessons or, uh, or like soccer coaching um, or whatever, you know, so it's kind of the same type of thing. But anyway, that's the first one. I'm really excited about it. I hope you guys uh, are as well. And if you have any questions, do let me know either on Discord or in the comments. I will do my best to respond and, uh, and get that all worked out. But I definitely look forward to working with any of you that are interested for sure. Uh, and then the next announcement is even bigger. And the reason I say this for a second is because it, it has a little bit more uh, a background with it. I, uh, as of Tuesday of this week, which I believe was the 13th, um, I put in my two weeks notice at work. I am quitting my day job to do this full time, which is pretty crazy. It still hasn't sunk in yet, guys. And uh, it's it's really ridiculous. Like, I, I may not sound as excited as I should be. Like I said, it hasn't really sunk in yet. And I don't think it will until I actually wake up, uh, you know, on the first Monday where I don't have to go to work and, and realize it. Uh, but... It's, it's a huge move. I've been wanting to do it for months and months and months, and I feel like between the, le the, the coaching sessions I'm offering and, uh, you know, how YouTube's going and the Patreon and some other stuff I'm working on on the side that uh, I am at a spot where I can do this, uh, you know, without, like, being in the hole every single month or at least not too much and, uh, and really grow the channel to where, you know, I hope it can be and, and just do a lot of stuff. It's going to be really exciting. It's a big move, but I'm super excited. And, uh, you know, when I announced it on stream, you guys were overwhelmingly supportive. And I thank you all so much for that. It's uh, it's really, really amazing. And it's, it's all thanks to you guys, pretty much, that I'm able to do this. So uh, I'm working until, uh, I think, a week from this coming Wednesday. Uh, it, so not this coming Wednesday, but the week after that Wednesday is my last day of work which is pretty close. So I only have like eight more days of work, which is pretty awesome. And uh, you know what, so what does this mean? This means uh, this means more live streams. That's gonna be my first focus. Uh, I would like to go up to four live streams a week. We're gonna start with three. I'm, I currently do two, but I wanna scale up a little bit just so I don't like push it too much. But uh, we're gonna start with three streams a week. If that seems comfortable and I can do more, we're gonna go to four. And uh, content wise, it may not mean more factorial content, depending on what it is, just because uh, I don't want to, you know, over flood the channel with factorial because a lot of you guys can't keep up as it is. Uh, but what it does mean is a lot more varied content in addition to the factorial content. As I mentioned many times before, it's it, it's been very difficult for me to keep up the non-factorial games while still keeping the factorial content consistent due to time constraints and energy constraints. Uh, but you know, once I'm out of my day job. You know, I will be able to do that on a much more regular basis, record other games. I really want to play Surviving Mars. That came out uh, yesterday, and uh, I definitely want to do a series on that. Uh, you know, they are billions. I want to continue that, and anything else that looks interesting. There's a few games I have my eyes on, and uh, and yeah, so it's really exciting. Uh, you know, maybe more factorial content. We'll see where things go. Uh, like I said, I don't want to over flood things that way. But definitely more streams, you know, I'll just be around more, like on Discord, you know, I should be around more as it is now. I try to be, but, you know, it, it is hard to always be around, so uh, that will be better, and it's just going to be, it's just going to be really great. I'm really excited, guys, and, uh, and yeah, so that's kind of uh, caused uh, some, some stress issues and such, uh, not, not stress in terms of actually like making the transition but stressed in terms of like how to address it with my my boss and stuff uh because it's um you know my boss is really great and, and stuff he's not someone who, who i you know it's not like a bad boss where i'll just be like and just go in and be like a total asshole about quitting or something you know it's uh it, it was really stress stressing on uh stressful to, to think about how to go about that and then to, you know, work on some other things. Like I said, I'm working on some other things that are actually not uh, YouTube or Twitch or content related at all um, that have required a lot of my time, which was also stressful and all that kind of combined made me not sleep and uh, made me a little bit sick. Uh, you know, stress can affect people in different ways. Some people, you know, it makes them not sleep, which I wasn't, or it gives them headaches or... Uh, 
or stuff like that, or it can mess up, you know, their digestive system, which was my problem. Um, so it, it was just, it was a bit tough, but hopefully within the next week or so, things will even out and, uh, and really start looking up. So thank you guys so much for everything deeply from the bottom of my heart. Thank you so much. Uh, really great stuff on the horizon, the coaching, uh, definitely check out the website if you're interested at all. And, if, and again, if you have any questions or anything about it, uh, then message me on Discord or in the comments. Discord's probably better. Uh, like if you ping me in my channel or even just direct message me, um, then, then that's great. And anyway, I'd love to hear any thoughts you have. Thanks again so much as always for all the support. And until next time, I look forward to seeing you all and do take care, guys.